in that part of my piece, I have all those diamond, those notational little dots. But that's actually for the vibrato, the strength of the vibrato, the pressure of the vibrato. Because when you're playing the erhu, there's one technique called the yaro, which means to press and then vibrate. So the pressing itself, you can't really hear it orally, but it actually helps in the intensity of the vibrato. So with the violin, so there's one part, it's like like I like that part where you press and then you vibrate. So there's a short gap in between that sound, uh, the two sounds. So I wanted that to be the most important aspect of this Ode to Remembrance because that's the most uh, melodious section of my piece. 